Here we go again, another powerful politician in Albany, named now in a corruption scandal. Senate Leader Dean Skelos and his son Adam turned themselves into federal authorities in New York today. Skelos is accused of using his political power to make deals, earning millions of dollars for the company where his son works. So what are local lawmakers saying about this tonight? 7 Eyewitness News reporter Hannah Bueller here now with reaction and the comment from Skelos himself. And Joanna, now it's the Senate that's dealing with the same issues as the Assembly did earlier this year with Sheldon Silver and local leaders in both the Senate and Assembly. Democrats and Republicans calling for Skelos to step down now from his powerhouse position. Western New York Republican Assemblywoman Jane Corwin issued a statement today calling for Skelos to step down. Corwin says she's disheartened by the allegations and says the alleged corruption is clouding what really needs to be done in Albany. Skelos and his son Adam turned themselves in to the FBI this morning in New York City. The 67-year-old leader of the Senate is accused on six different counts of federal corruption, including extortion, bribes, and solicitation charges. All that, they say, for the benefit of himself and his son. The Dean Skelos unlawfully used his power and influence as Senate Majority Leader repeatedly to illegally enrich his son, Adam, and indirectly himself. It's my belief that we need to move forward as quickly as possible to enact strong ethics reform, to ban outside income. No individual should be making hundreds of thousands of dollars on the side while they're out there doing the people's business. The Senate leader Dean Skello says he's innocent of the charges filed against him and he fully expects to be exonerated during a public trial. As of right now, Skelos and his son are awaiting a court appearance in Manhattan. Coming up all new at 6 tonight, Western New York Assemblyman Mickey Kern says term limits could clean up corruption in Albany. What he's proposing, that's at 6. Anna Bueller, 7 Eyewitness News.